In this video, we will explore ISO surfaces to check for separation points, create pressure sweep to inspect flow features. And finally, we will create streamlines. A separation bubble has flow traveling in the opposite direction which we can create an ISO surface to look at. Select X velocity from the options. Play around with the slider bar to view different ISO surface values. Input the value as shown for the ISO value and click Create. View the ISO surface created under Mesh. Create a sweep surface. Input the initial and final values as shown. Also input a value of 100 frames. Highlight contours. Deselect auto range, global range, clip to range and highlight filled. Input the minimum and maximum values. Deselect node values and, pick total pressure from the list. Pick symmetry from the surfaces. View it from the x-axis. Animate it. We can see the vortices forming and general features of the flow. Create a line. Select points with mouse, and right click on the mesh to choose the points. Change the Y coordinates as shown as we wanted the line to be elevated off the ground. Create path lines. Select the line that we have created. Change the line width to two under attributes. Have the path skip as one and display the path lines. Draw the mesh without the edges. Display the path lines again. Use pulse to animate the path lines. You can play around with the step size and other settings to increase the length of the pulses. Now, we are going to learn how to create a pressure contour and streamlines in CFD post. Drag results into solution and, edit the results. Let us now create a pressure contour. Choose the car surfaces as shown. Change the number of contours to 20. Let us create a line to release the streamlines from. Input the coordinates of both the points as shown. Create a velocity streamline. Choose the line that we have created from this list. Change the maximum points to 200. Deselect the wireframe. Let us now create an animation. Choose the streamline created. Change the symbol size to 0.2 under options. Slide the frame rate bar to slow. 
Let us see the animation now. We can inspect the streamlines near the front wing also. Thank you for watching, and this concludes the video series on the aerodynamics of FSAE car.